Hey, Kathy, how are you, girl? Hi, teacher. Hi, how are you doing? Pretty good. Hey, that's great. There you go. Okay, there you go. Much better. <laughs> Hi, nice to have you here. All right, so yesterday it was a boy who was the first one to arrive to the class, and now it's going to be a girl. Amazing. I yesterday, I don't know why I, I couldn't connect. Uh -huh. I don't yeah. know why, because I, I, I just get a time at class, but I couldn't, I don't know. But, but finally, you, enjoy, you joined today's, yesterday's class, right? But only uh, me, 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 me. Uh, like a 30 minutes. <laughs> yes, like a 30 minutes. Oh, I don't know what happened. Uh, sometimes, um, well, it, I don't know why, because you, most of the time you have no problem, right? I always connect uh, with the direction. Uh huh. I have in, the, in my email. But yesterday, I don't know why. Okay. But I don't send the, the direction, the, the enlace. <laughs> yeah, the link. A link and the uh, chat. Ah, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, I saw that. Uh, he sent it uh, to you. Yeah, yeah, I was like, yeah, thank you, Byron. I, yeah, it was really, it was really, uh, maybe, you know what? Uh, Zoom has an updated recently. So uh, maybe that could be the reason why. Because yes, I you sometimes you need to like double check if you already have the updated Mirna, version. Mirna, Mirna uh, have problem like me. Really? Yes. Oh my God! All right. I was trying to connect like. Uh huh. Like, like half an hour. Yeah. I don't send the the link. The link? Uh huh. Yeah, it was really really weird that you couldn't because that's the regular way that you join class, right? It was really, it was really nice. Yeah, it's, it was really weird because I put it on time, so you cannot log in if I do not start the meeting, right? But um, in that case, that the meeting was already started, it was really complicated. Mm -hmm. You know what? Sometimes the technology or the computer doesn't want to cooperate with us. <laughs> that happens. I've been training in this whole week, and my trainer said, I don't know why, but this computer. The whole week, it looks like this is computer is on Friday <laughs> because sometimes when he wants to like share the things with us, with the, um, basically the tools that we need to learn to do our job, right? It, sometimes it's like loading, 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 loading. It's like, my good. And sometimes he was explaining something, then kick him out. And he was like, no way. So he's like, oh, yeah. So then he's frustrated because he said, no way. This computer has been like doing this with me. Basically, the, the whole training, he had like a little problems with the computer. I don't know why. Yeah, could be internet connection. It could be that the computer doesn't want to cooperate. Maybe the computer is <laughs> excited like, like us. <laughs> yeah, you know what? That happens. And that happens to me as well. Like, eh, I don't know why. Sometimes they do that. So, and so you know what? And sometimes I'm like, was like doing something, then the computer like uh, updated something in the, inside the software. And I was like, Ugh. that's why most of the time when me, my computer needs to update something, the software or update any. Um, Anything that I have it here, well, I always schedule it for Saturdays. So they can up, update any information, whatever they want, and I takes work, whatever lungs, but not during Saturday. my weekdays. You work on Saturday too, teacher. Uh, no, 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 not right now. <laughs> not right now. Hopefully, I don't, right? Because I, you don't have to rest. Yeah, I do have to rest. I have time with your dogs. <laughs> yeah, I do. I do. Yeah, the, the the first thing that I do that I do when I arrive back home, they like they're waiting for me. <laughs> uh, you cannot imagine they're just jumping. They're trying to hug. They're trying to give me a kiss. But since I'm coming out, the first thing that I do is I take out my shoes and go directly where is the washing machine. So I took out all the clothes, put it there. To be washed and then i put on some new ones mm -hmm. because i'm coming from outside 
So I need to take care about my babies. Mm -hmm. That's the reason why. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I love them. And I we know. hug each other and we join to together into the bed, you know, hugging. Yeah, yeah. But today, to be that. honest with you, I've been sleepy the whole day. I'd be like this the whole day. And even though I drank like uh, three cup of teas, teas, coffee, sorry. Uh, mm -hmm. I, you know what? I, I was not able to wake up. I think I, I was I was not mentally tired, but I was my eyes were like I, I felt it like heavy. Like when you are like have been in front of the computer for so long that they are like itchy that um so I, I thought I need to rest a little bit and I took a nap today like a half an hour nap and that was ah, awesome because I have more energy to be with you yeah you're right about something Katy. I need to rest because I work a lot <laughs> I do work a lot but I love to be with you guys well I've kiddos kiddos I don't know why Eh, kiddos. I don't know why my trainer eh, is referring to us like kiddos. <laughs> I'm going to ask him yesterday why he said that, <laughs> but that's okay. You know what? It's going to be girls' night, I think, because only Maria and only Kathy and Mitch. That's cool. That's awesome. Let me ask you guys something, girls. Do you like to, to tell stories? Do you love stories? Yes. Yeah, you do. Okay. What kind of stories do you like? Do you like like suspension yeah. stories? Excuse me, I don't. Aha! Uh -huh. You haven't had mm -hmm. your earphones, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's like okay. Romantic. Yeah. romantic. Oh, okay. And drama. And drama. All right. Uh, mm -hmm. So you have you love love and prejudice, right? You remember that book? Orgullo y Prejuicio, Love and Prejudice. Yes. That's amazing. But audio book. What? Prefer audio. I prefer, I prefer the book. book. Oh, yes. The book is like this. But I, I prefer the book in English. <laughs> yes. You know what is really nice? Because the, 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 ink, the, the English version basically is a British one, but it's for the, I don't know, for the earlier centuries. So you can find a really interesting and amazing vocabulary there that you cannot imagine. Sometimes it will be hard to understand some expressions, but it's really good because that's the only way that you can increase your vocabulary. Reading. Right, and you're proud of the person. It's really nice. How about suspension uh, stories or horror stories? Do you like it? Spooky? No. Spooky? No? no? Yeah? What? No, no? What kind of stories do you like, Maria? I love for from Edgar Allan Poe and Agatha Christie. Uh -huh. Exactly, Mr. Oh, Agatha yeah. Christie, yeah. Edgar Allan Poe, yes. yes. Edgar Allan Poe. Like well, they're yes. similar, right? They're similar. Yeah. Right? Like, yeah. like Agatha Christie, yeah. Edgar Allan Poe, yeah. Uh, I love the birds from Edgar Allan Poe. The birds, yeah, yeah the birds. Ugh. You know what? Yeah. I, was, um, I was able to be, let me check. I, I was in Magic Kingdom in the States. I was in the States, Imagine Kingdom. And there was an area when they were like projecting a movie, a 3D movie, 3D movie. And it was based on the birds from Edgar Allan Poe. So you were using like a 3D, uh, what do you say? Glass, glasses, yeah. Oh, yeah. and, and you know what? And, and it was like, because, because the, the, there was a bird, right? So you have... A, you can see you you felt like you were in the middle of all the birds and you can see the fits right the nails coming through you like this like yee! oh my goodness that was really amazing <laughs> but you know what and, and i like it but you know what and i i think my grandma my grandma was still alive by then and she went to magic kingdom before me so but in a, in a different year in a different month and it was exactly the same thing, but instead of projecting uh, the birds from Elgar Allan Poe, it was projecting. How, do you remember the movie Ben? That I think Michael Jackson uh, sings the soundtrack of that movie. It's like a like like a huge rat 
<laughs> no, yeah, like a huge rat. And it was basically uh, the domination of the rats in that neighbor, right? In that neighborhood. So uh, yeah, it, it was a, a, the rats attacks, for example. So my, my grandma was wearing those glasses, but you know what she, she said? Everybody was, ah! on the movie and everybody was doing like with the with the with the foot right because in that movie they projected like with the army with the army of rats going through and pass it over everybody's feet wow. so that we, yeah so you felt oh. like you yeah that our, our army on ads were coming <laughs> to you and was passing under your seat. So can you imagine everybody's like ah, freaking out because you felt that it was real. Oh my God, that was amazing. <laughs> Including my grandma. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Those kind of, we're talking guys. Thank you so much for joining today's class. We have Byron, Lucito, Alex, and Anita and Francisco. We were talking about stories, guys. And I was asking uh, Kathy and, and Maria, what kind of stories did they, that they, they like? They said um, they love um, romantic, like Kathy, right? Yeah. But also like, well, uh, Kathy likes uh, Agatha Christie as well, and also Maria likes Edgar Allan Poe, which is basically yeah. uh, they turn it up to having like those kind of uh, spooky stories, right? Like, ooh, like suspension, mm -hmm. like detective ones, right? Mm -hmm. Those are really nice mm -hmm. ones. They are really, they are really, really amazing creators mm -hmm. and writers. But it's different when you read it, when that when when you listen, somebody telling you the story right yeah he's yeah it's, it's really different okay so <laughs> let me ask you something um let me check i was double checking something before i get into you guys and um i figured it out basically a lot of things for example um what do you think at uh, the top stories could be um well i have a different topics and uh, let me check uh, entertainment, sports, travel, opinions, health. What? Uh, let me ask you. In your opinion, uh, which story or which news could be interesting? Something related to politics, technology, science, sports. What would be your uh, your um, preferred topic? I prefer opinions. <laughs> opinions. All right. Hey, very good. What about science? Uh -huh. I don't know. Entertainment? Uh, I don't know. I prefer history. Travel. Uh, Travel. Cool. History. Travel. Studies. Studies. All right. Very good. Okay. Yeah. So each of us has like a specific topic, right? Yeah. That's why we decide to like to check for a specific uh, information if you're on the on a website or if you're on a TV, you just select whatever it makes you feel comfortable. All right, so what I want you guys to do, we're gonna to start this right now. And we're gonna start with the listening part, right? Hey, Byron, thank you so much for joining today's class. Hey, I think he's on the uh, at home right now. That's amazing. Finally, he's, he's having like a <laughs> relaxing moment, right? A poor Byron. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. basically, guys, this is what I want. I want you guys to let me know. This is going to be, uh, basically three news stories and i want you guys to let me know in which is in which category we can put them on are there stories about science about sports about travel opinion health so i just want you guys to let me know that okay basically that's what i want right now Hi, teacher. Yes, I'm at home finally. <laughs> finally. Yeah, you look so relaxed, so that's why very good. So we're going to listen to the three stories, and I want you guys just to think about in which category we can, like, put them on, right? That's just that right now, right now, okay? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to play it. in this For this time, I'm going to play it one by one, so I'm going to make a stop after each story so we can, like, discuss a little bit. All righty. So, are you ready, guys? Hey, Javier, thank you so much. Welcome to the jungle. Welcome to today's class. <laughs> oh, my God. I have so many guys wearing a black outfit, including me. Hey, at what time do you put your outfit? So, who copy who? I'm just kidding. All right. 
So very good. <laughs> there you go. Okay. You Four. Go. Excellent. What a story. Yep. Page 22, exercise two, perspectives. Surprise endings. Part A. Listen to the news stories. In which news category from exercise one do you think each story belongs? An attempted robbery took place at Eastern Bank today. A man was trying to rob the bank, but he wasn't very lucky. While he was escaping from the bank, the robber got caught in the revolving door. The police arrived and took the man to jail. Okay, guys, so according to that, uh, in which category we can put that story? Is it opinions, is it health, entertainment, politics? What, it's what a is news. It? news. It's a news. 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 Okay, very good. Okay, let's continue with the second one. It was a strange soccer match last night. The Bears won the game, but the Lions scored the winning goal for them. As Jake Walters was running toward the ball, he tripped and accidentally kicked it into the wrong goal. The score was Bears 1, Lions 0. What about the, the second one? Sport. It's a sport. 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 Sports, right? Cool. Let's listen to the third one. An electrical problem at PAX Arena interrupted a Planets concert last night. The Planets were performing a new song when the lights went out, but the show went on. The Planets continued to play in the dark, and the lights came back on an hour later. Oh my God, what about this one? Entertainment. 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 All right. I guess huh? this is really? what I it's news? Yeah, but also it's entertainment because it's talking about what? Entertainment. Okay. Yeah. Okay, cool. So now, God, that you we already classified stories that we can say that. Okay, now let's listen again, each of them. And I want you guys to let me know, but don't tell me the whole story, okay? I just want you to let me know in your <laughs> own words in a resume, like like in two or three sentences at the most, what is this each story about, okay? What had happened? There you go. Uh, did you understand? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yes. Yeah. Unit four. What a story. Page 22, exercise two, perspectives. Surprise endings. Part A. Listen to the news stories. In which news category from exercise one do you think each story belongs? An attempted robbery took place at Eastern Bank today. A man was trying to rob the bank, but he wasn't very lucky. While he was escaping from the bank, the robber got caught in the revolving door. The police arrived and took the man to jail. All right, so what is this story about? It's about a robbed bank. The, bank. the robber is caught on uh -huh. the door. Uh-huh, and what had happened to the thief? Did the police could cut them? Yes. Could arrest him? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Put in the jail. Yes. Very good. Excellent. Let's double check the second one. It was a strange soccer match last night. The Bears won the game, but the Lions scored the winning goal for them. As Jake Walters was running toward the ball, he tripped and accidentally kicked it into the wrong goal. The score was Bears 1, Lions 0. All right, so what is this a story about? About it's sport. A football. It's a soccer it's match. A soccer match. match. Soccer Do match. you remember what are the names of the of the team? Lions 1. Lions 1, Lions one. and what is the other name? <laughs> Bears. 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 <laughs> what about Bears? Nice. What was the scores? One or zero? One for One Bears and zero. Very good. Okay. Uh -huh. Very good. Now, let's listen to the third one. An electrical problem at PAX Arena interrupted a Planets concert last night. The Planets were performing a new song when the lights went out, but the show went on. 
the planets continued to play in the dark, and the lights came back on an hour later. All right, what happened in this one? It's, it's, in a, it's an electrical problem in Irene. Irene is like a stadium. Exactly. I think the concert yes. was planet but, concert, uh, right? But, but at the end, continue with the plants, play with on the dark. Exactly. So the concert, you know, nobody will stop it. Yeah. What, like uh, like one of the Mr. X Freddy's Mercury is son, Queen, the show must yes. go on, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Remember that? Mm -hmm. The show mm -hmm. must go on. Wow. One of my yes. favorite uh, band, mm -hmm. Queen. Yeah. All righty. They're okay. awesome. So, okay, guys, very good. So I just want you guys to notice, this is not, not only to just to help you develop the skills, but also, guys, to make you identify about something. Each story has like a really nice story, right, by the way. But if you notice, every time that you've been listening to each of them, there were like one action already started when something else appears or somebody else appears and interrupt the action that has already been in process. So guys, uh, why I put this audio? Because um, when we like to talk about stories, it doesn't matter if you're a reporter or not a reporter, right? Uh, but so, and sometimes we like to express ourselves with more complex ideas, with more complex stories there's a hundred percent sure that you're going to be able to use basically two type of verb tenses. If you're talking about the past, which is was in the in the case of these three stories, the three scenarios that we just heard. Alrighty. So in this case, guys, we were using two kind of verb tenses. We were using past continuous and simple past. Okay. You know how to use them separately. But in order for you to express yourself or tell a really good story in complex ideas, you must use both of them together. And it's possible. And it's possible. But for example, how do I use it? Mm. It's easy. Don't complicate your life. You're like, me. no, 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 no. And let me give an example. Um, let's pretend I don't know what that what had happened to you but I think everybody have passed through this situation let's pretend that we are really tired and everything the first things that we need to that we want to do when we arrive back home is to take a shower right uh, with a hot or a cold water well I prefer hot water because here it was like zzz, really freezing on my house but okay. I had to be brave and I need to like took a cold water so like Ooh, but anyway, I, I had to do it. I'm I'm brave girl. So okay, but you know what? I don't know. Sometimes that happens that you're starting taking a shower, you're enjoying your bath, and then you like sound like ring, ring, and you were like, oh my god, right? So you said I was taking a shower, or I had been take. I was taking a shower when my mother called, or when my mm -hmm. girlfriend called. You see, so what okay. was the action that has already been started? That you were already taking a shower, right? So that was past, mm -hmm. past continuous, right? I was taking a shower, yeah. but in the middle, in the process of the, that action, there was something else that interrupted the action, but it's still in the past, right? So when mm -hmm. you're talking mm -hmm. about something that a second action that interrupts the first one, then you're going to use the simple past. What was the second action that interrupts the first one? That my mother called me. You see? Yeah. And I had to like be like in a towel, right? Answer the phone. And then when I finished, going back to the to the bathroom and continue my activity, right? You see how yeah. it works? It's easy. And you see, we use together in order for us to make complex ideas and to make also not only to make a, a good sentences but and good structure, but at the same time, when we're talking about stories, we would need to use both bird tenses. And it's really easy. Right now, let me let me ask you so far, 
Any questions right now? I'm going to share no. my screen right now because it's really important and I want you guys to take a look at this. Okay, I made my presentation. All right, I will give you an example right now. Take a look at this one. It's amazing, right? <laughs> All right. So take a look at this, guys. An action A. What's happening in the past when an action B interrupt? What is the action A, guys? What is this one? What is the first one? I was having a shower, right? The one that I, the example that I gave it to you. Okay. And what happened in the meantime that I was teacher. having a shower, guys? Yes? Teacher? Yes, Hello? I'm listening to I, you. I don't know if maybe it's, uh, yeah. I have a, uh, uh -huh. I, I'm back. I looked at, I look. no, 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 no. I, I looked at your screen, but it's not uh, clearly. It's burly? Just me. No, uh, clearly, no clearly. Uh -huh, it's burly. I, I don't know if it's for me. I don't know, guys. Can you can you uh, see my screen? Is, is it clear? Yes. The screen, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes, it's well, clear. Uh, so I think it's your internet. No, no, no. Maybe I need to buy a new computer. Okay, go. Ah. <laughs> oh my God! No, I didn't yeah. mean that. Okay. okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. So okay. let me okay. go back to business. Would you like me to make it a little bit bigger, yeah. Alex? Let me check. Let me okay. Try okay. The big one. What about now? Is it better? No. No. Yes. Yeah. But not for Alex, okay. I think. Better than B. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So, guys, this is the thing. Okay, let okay. me check it out. Okay, there you go. Okay. Okay. What is the action A, guys? What is action A? It was he was having a shower, continuous. right? Yes. Why is past continuous? Because I know that I'm using the bird to be, remember? and the ing form of the verb. So basically this action, action A, is already being started. But I was in the middle of taking a shower when suddenly what happened, guys? The phone, the phone, phone rang. The phone rang. Run, exactly. Wow, in the past. Exactly. The simple past. Simple past. Ex simple past, exactly. So you see, both actions are in the past, but the B interrupts the first one. Yeah. You see? It, guys, I want you guys to let me to uh to focus on something because every time guys that, that we use a word which is while or also guys there's another word that we can also add here and is the word as okay so every time that you use as or while you will always going to use most of the time past continuous okay so you can say it while he was having a shower, or also you can say, as he was having a shower, coma, the phone rang. Okay? You can also say that. Are you with me? Yes, teacher. Yes, okay. yes teacher. Very good. And also you can, you can also use it, but also you cannot use it. Like the second example. Ah. He was having a shower okay. when the phone rang. Rang. Run, run. Remember that is the pass of ring, right? Yes. Yes. Okay, cool. So you see how is it really important, but at the same time, how easy it is? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Can I said the phone run while he was having a shower? Nope. Are you sure? He's passing voice. Yes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, very good. Okay, there's something that I want you to pay attention to. The past continuous, guys, describes okay. a longer action or situation. And the action described by the past simple tense interrupts the situation described by the past continuous. So while, guys, it is usually used before continuous tenses, and when it is usually used before simple tenses. Let's take a look at the examples that I have here. Let me check it out here. Here you go. Okay. For example, the first one. It was raining hard when he left the hospital. Okay. This is the past continuous. Mm -hmm. And this one is the simple past. Okay. You can also use the second one. I can use while. You see, this one I'm going to use while. While I was having lunch, Peter rang. Mm -hmm. Rang. Okay, 
you can say mm -hmm. run run in this case it could be like you receive a message or you, you receive a phone call from peter okay all righty is it clear right now easy easy quizzy yes yes any yes. questions guys kathy javier mr molina i don't know uh -huh. mm -hmm. let me take let me uh, give you guys some tip some hint Hint is like an extra help, extra mile. There's a difference between simple past and versus past continuous, which is also is really important that you know, okay? For example, we use, we use a simple past to talk about what, guys? To talk about actions, habits, facts, and the past. And I'll give you an example. I went to the cinema yesterday. I was, I always visit my grandparents in my summer holidays, okay, when I was a little, and I lived near Liverpool for a couple of years. Point. Now, past continuous, we use it interrupted actions, a specific time. This is really important as an interruption and a parallel actions. And I will give an example. I was watching TV when the phone rang. You see, last night at yeah. seven, I was having dinner. While she was doing her homework, her brother was playing football. Is it understandable, the difference? Yeah. Yeah? Yes. yes. Are you sure? A hundred percent? Who's? Ah, oh, no, no, no. Who's sleeping with me? Nobody will be able to be asleep. Ah, stand up. Ah. <laughs> ah. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, let me double check. We're going to play the game. Because I don't want everybody to be like, <sighs> okay, <laughs> whatever and never, no okay. way. Ah, let me check what is the game that we're going to play. Allow me just a couple of minutes, okay? <laughs> let me check. I have it here. I know I have it here in some places. I just spin wheel. <laughs> this is what I uh, uh, uh. No. Let me check if I have it here. Mm, I think I need to like update some information here. Ah. Okay, there you go. Uh -huh. This is what I'm going to use. <laughs> Are you guys ready? Okay, guys. It could be either positive or negative. Okay. So I want you guys to give me a sentence in the past. Positive or negative. Depends of the of the roule of the spin. I don't know who's going to be. Mm. Okay, but first of all, do me a favor. I'm thinking about a number between one and twelve. Can I have a number, please, Byron? um 11 now can i have a number alex uh -uh, i cannot hear you. your microphone is off three no. number three no kathy no. five no francisco ten no and maria seven yes Thank you so much. <laughs> oh, okay, lucky you. Okay, let me share right now my screen. And um, we're going to play roulette. All right, let me check. Now I'm going to change it. There you go. Positive. Okay, give me a positive sentence in the past. Me? Yes, of course. Okay. <laughs> a positive sentence in the past. Simple past. A simple past. Okay. A simple past tense, but have positive. Okay. Um, oh, it's, wow. You can, it's... you can say anything. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I worked too much uh, yesterday because I, I traveled to Ilovasco. No, um, don't don't give me the whole, oh the whole no, only, only one. Only the sentence. Yeah. Only. Okay. Yeah, only the sentence. Is that positive for you? Yes, I traveled uh, okay. for to Ilubasco yesterday. 
Very good. That's good. Awesome. Excellent job. Okay, continue. Okay, and one number from one to, to 11. Okay, Mr. Molina, can I have one number, please? But turn your microphone on because your microphone is off. Uh, one number. No, one uh, number between one and 11. Uh, in one? No, oh, in one. <laughs> <laughs> but no, uh, but thank you. Okay. No, no, wait. Okay, no, no eight, no one. Okay, let me double check with the other one. Thank you, Mr. Molina. Mr. Luis, what about okay. you? Number five. No. Francisco. Number easy, two. Easy. Number two. No. What about no. you, Alex? I know. Number nine. No. What about you, Javier? Huh? Number eight. No. What about you, no. Candy? No. 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 Francisco already said number two. Try another one. One. <laughs> No, uh, Mr. Molina, say that, that number once again. Another one. Four. Nah. Byron, what about you? Somewhat said six. No. All right. Anita. Four. What about you, Anita? No. Oh, no. If anything, it's, 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 it's not able right now. What about you, Elsie? 11. <laughs> no. Maria, what about you? Four. No. Nah. <laughs> Huh? Now, Javier, what about no. you? Oh, Mr. Molina, sorry. Uh, uh, nine. No, uh, Alex already said that. Another one. Okay, 12. No, I think I said a number between one and 11. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> 10. Yes, 10? thank you so much. Yeah, <laughs> very good. So let me share right now my screen. And then uh, comes the Hule once again. Positive. A positive sentence in the past. But, uh, positive. Positive sentence. And and uh, and past. you can use only simple past, Sim or you can uh, use simple. a combination of both. Past continuous versus simple past. You have the two options. Uh, uh, last night, uh, I was uh, I was later, uh, and last night I was I was I was I was working later. I was working later. Uh huh. When? And when 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 the the light off. When the lights went off. Okay. Ah, so that means it's nice because you you couldn't come finish your work, right? You went back to to bed <laughs> early. <laughs> okay, so that was yes, positive. Yes, yes. <laughs> Very good. Excellent. Okay. Uh huh. Let me pick another pick another victim. Sorry, another participant. The last one. Yeah. Okay. A number between one and ten. Go ahead, Alex. Nine. No. Nah. What about you, Luisito? Good. <laughs> Eight. No. What about you, Frank? Me. He says me. Yeah. No, Frank, but don't worry. Oh, okay. uh -huh. number five. Yes, thank you so much. Okay. Ah, I kill you. <laughs> <laughs> Shame on you. No, just kidding. <laughs> All right. I don't know if it's lucky or I don't know what. I don't know. <laughs> Me neither. All right. Best <laughs> okay. okay. Oof. Negative. Oh my God. Negative. Negative sentence. Negative using uh, past continuous and simple past together. Okay. Um, ay, ay, ay. <laughs> Remember, past continues while or as an ing form. Mm -hmm. But in negative, see, uh, I construct the positive. Uh, it, I turn for a negative. <laughs> uh -huh, yes. Oh, negative. It is not. It's not necessary that you put the verbs in negative. Negative could be that the situation was negative. 
Oh, okay. Uh -huh. For you, I of was, course. I was discussing with my boss when he closed the door. Wow, what that would be really unrespectful. <laughs> yeah, because uh, sh she's hungry in this moment. She was she was hungry. Hang she was hungry. Okay, if you can do that Fine. in a call center, you're gonna be fired. <laughs> but, yeah, uh, definitely but, you will. But I will revenge. <laughs> right. And everybody will will call Mr. Francisco Avenger, right? <laughs> Yeah. All right. Very <laughs> good. <laughs> okay. Excellent job. Now, let me ask you, are you awake? Yes. You know, uh, you know what awake is? Yes. Yeah. If we were like this, because I'm everybody awake. was like, no. <sighs> oh, you mean me. We need yes, everybody. Practice. Are you awake? Just a yeah. Yes. 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 yeah. Okay. I wake up. Uh -huh. yeah. you see going okay going back to business all righty so nobody will fall asleep in my classes no way i'm not gonna let that happen <laughs> all right no, guys. Happen. no no no, okay. no 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 that's not possible all righty so guys let's do something let's do a um like a practice right now um basically like, like what can i say a writing activity so what I'm going to do right now is we'll have like three news. A, well, the first one is Golden Find. The other one will be for leg like customers. And the last one is Rescue the Ambulance. So what I want you to do, uh, each sentence or each uh, story, guys, basically, you would need to, um, to fill in the blanks, if I can say that. I'm going to show it to you right now. So I'm going to put it a little bit bigger. All right, there you go. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> I love this one. Very good. Okay, let me make it a little bit bigger in order for me to share my screen with you really quickly. Okay, can you see it, guys? Yeah? Yeah. Okay, cool. So you see, you have these three stories, and I'm going to send it to you in a moment. And this is what I want to do. If you see, guys, this stories are incomplete is that right but yes. you are you are able to see guys that each story has like a verb in parentheses okay a verb in parentheses yeah. so yes. this is what i want you to do i want you guys to finish the ideas of each sentences with the verbs that are already in parentheses however you're i want you guys to pay attention to the sentences because you will be you will need to use the past continuous and the simple past together okay and i want you guys to mm -hmm. figure it out if the first sentence is in past continuous or is in the simple past or, okay so okay. that's what i want right now guys what i'm going to do is that we're going to divide it into groups okay in order for you to like okay be nice all right okay. so uh, 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 uh. first of all i'm going to send it to the whatsapp so everybody can have it and uh, yeah. then I'm going to split it into the um, into groups. Bear with me for a couple of minutes more. Let me update it really quickly. There you go. Okay. Mm -hmm. Be careful while you're singing. I don't know, but I feel I like to sing today. There you go. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, everybody, each group, guys, will work all the three stories. Okay. Okay, I will give you only five minutes to complete the three stories. So let me double check how many we have so far. How many we are? We are 11. I mean, 10 with, with me, 11, right? But 10. So that means that it will be five groups of two, right? Okay, I'm good in math today. I don't know why. Okay, so I'm going to divide it. I'm going to create five groups and I'm going to assign it. I'm going to create it. Okay. So let me double check. Okay. Alex and, the, 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 and Javier, they're going to work together. Anita is going okay. to work with Mr. Miss Elsie. Byron is going to work with Mr. Henry. Francisco is going to work with Kathy. And Luis is going to work with Maria. 
please accept invitation. All of you will need to work on the three stories. I will give you five minutes. Right now it's 842. Let's see you guys at 847, okay? Okay. There you go. Please accept the invitation and work on the exercise. Did you say levitation, Mr. Molina and Alex? Anita? Okay. Only Anita's missing. Let me check this one. Let me check each of them. Hello. Yes, Byron. Hi. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> we were in another group. I know. I switched right now. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> don't worry. Um. But you got accept invitation. Yep. Okay, but you're still with me. Just kidding. Okay. <laughs> don't worry. Continue working with with Anita. I don't know if it's Anita's here. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully I she think answers. You make also on the platform, I think. I don't know if <laughs> no, you're done it good. It. If not, that's okay. And I'm searching then... for it as well. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Anita, hopefully better. she can, yeah, she can still work. <laughs> I don't know if Anita will be able to work right now with you. So if not, uh, I'm going to switch back right now to you. Okay, I'm sorry if you're like, like coming from back and forward, back and forward. Let me check it out. <laughs> Let me put you with somebody else. Let me check. Okay. Mm, I'm going to put you with uh, Henry and Louis. Tell me it's going to be better. There you go. Oh, Hello. Sure. Welcome back to the jungle, right? Okay. So you're back with Louis and Mr. Henry Molina. Oh, it's, it's yeah. time is over, guys. Sorry. Teacher, <laughs> and you haven't fit and you haven't started, right? I am confused with that activity because I changed the group. I know, I know. I don't do it on purpose. It's a strategy. Oh, I found oh, it on okay. the platform. I already did. Like, it's the uh, thing. But don't copy. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's not the same, I think. There is other two stories. Mm hmm so no way yeah all righty okay we'll give you three more minutes okay well drivers work work guys where check out the groups they discovered 
a contain gold work to me. First, in a coffee shop. Coming. Yeah, uh -huh. when I'm coming. With a woman. When a woman. Hop. hop. Pass. What is it? Hop. Coming. What coming? When What's coming? Maybe. Maybe having, having, having. Having, but we don't use was or where. Having breakfast. Okay. The car checker um, was going. Was going. going. Yeah. Yes. Was going over ninety miles an hour when. Catch. Our patrol finally uh -huh. catch up, catch up, caught, caught up with okay. Good, that's all, huh? Yes, did you finish? Yes, yes did you? I, oh my finished. god, we're good. Also, you're so fast. Okay, let's come back together. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Okie dokie. Bye, Francisco. Bye. So we're back together. We're going to wait for the rest of the guys to join the class, okay? Uh-huh. Okay, was it easy? Yeah, it was not complicated, right? It's not complicated, it? but the, the last uh, uh, example, uh -huh. um, Uh, I was a verb uh, in the form in the simple past. I don't know. Is it correct? Alert. Oh, alerted. Ah, we're going to double check that in a minute. Don't worry about it. That's why we're <laughs> going to do it like together, like as a group. Okay, we have Mr. Molina, Javier, and Francisco. Teacher, yeah, what Francisco. is the meaning of the bear hop? Hop. Yes. Where is yeah. it? How you spell it? How you spell mm. that verb? H O P. It's a uh, infinitive. H O P. H O P. H O P. H -O -P. Or, or, uh -huh. Where it, uh, was uh, uh, in the third in the third one, right? Yes. Yeah, yes. When one. a woman. When a woman. When a woman. Uh, okay. Hop. Hobbit. Or oh, hobbit. I don't mean know. H O P. Yeah. Uh -huh. Hobbit. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I know. I know what you're talking about. Okay. Hope could be many things. You can also use. It's it's like um, when somebody jumps. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A jump over. Como yes. que saltó. Right? Saltó. Yes. Like hop, like book. Ya sea que saltó o ya sea que se metió. Como de un saltito. That is what means hope. Hope. Okay. No yes. hope. Because hope is means esperanza. No. Yes. And yes. Hop. Yes. It's yeah. hop. Yeah. Hop. Yes. hop. 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 Very good. Okay, so let's join today together. Let's let's make the, the exercise together. Okay. Let's double check what you got, guys. All right, I know that you're really okay. smart, so it's going to be really easy, peasy, quizy for you. All right, very good. Okay. Okay, the first one, a golden find. We're going to do something. I'm going to ask somebody to start reading using that complimentary mm -hmm. idea, and then I will stop that person, and I will ask somebody else to continue reading. So when you okay. guys, in this case, we're going to develop the reading skills as well. So I want you guys to please pay attention in a hundred percent, okay? So say, okay. teacher, where, okay. where, where where are we? No way, okay? Okay, guys. <laughs> All righty. So who's okay. gonna be starting? Okay, Francisco, can you please start with the golden find? Okay, a golden find. White divers were working off the coast of Florida. They discovered a shipwreck. Containing gold worth worth two million. Okay, stop there. Very good. Continue, Aria. The drivers were filming a show about the coral reef when they found the gold. 
Very good. When they found the gold. Very good. Excellent. Four ledger customers start the, uh, the information or the story. Luis. One windy day, mm -hmm. a woman was walking mm -hmm. her pet poodle. I don't know. Down pet, the pet poodle. 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 Ah, poodle. Down the street. A uh, higher style saw the dog out a window and and notice it's crazier very good okay so you said one windy day a woman was walking her pet puddle down the street and her stylist saw the dog through a window and noticed it's crazy here okay cool very good later byron i'm sorry <laughs> i thought uh -huh. i wasn't <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Later, second story. Later, <laughs> while the stylist created a new line of hair care products for for dogs and cats, they he came up with a, a new slogan. Even animals had bad hair her days very good but i use the second one is was right but what about the first one well the stylus was it in past yes. continuous or simple past what do you think past you continuous. said uh -huh. past continuous why past continuous why was past continuous it's an action uh, of course both of them are in actions but why was okay. the past continuous was creating was creating because, because you use the words while. Wow, remember that I let you know yes. the most of the time well and as will be with a past continuous. Yes. All right. So that's that's one of the keys, guys. Okay, very good. Very good. Right now I'm going to um pass another and the other uh, story, but then we're going to go back to the same stories because I want you guys to try to read it more uh, fluent. Okay, so let's go back to the third one. Who can rescue the ambulance? Let me start reading for me, please, Kathy. An ambulance driver was having breakfast in a coffee shop when a woman popped into his ambulance and drove away. Drove away, very good, stop there. Continue reading for me, please, Alex. Oh, let me check, I, I have a problem with that. Ah, with the let with the see, image. Yes. Is it better really, now? I can. Oh, you cannot see it. Okay, don't worry. No, That's ah, okay. Let me see. No, no. In, in my phone. In my phone. In my okay. phone. Uh, let me see. It, okay. Uh, is it into the in, into his ambulance or where? No, the driver. The, the driver. driver. Let me see. Let me see. Okay. Uh, the driver was grabbing his cell phone. And, and uh, alert the police, the, uh, the police, the, the carjacker went over nine, 90 miles an hour when this highway patrol finally catch, catch, catch it up with her. Very good. Kind of. but, but do you think that the driver was a simple pass or pass continuous? You said pass continuous, right? Yes, grabbing. The driver was grabbing the driver his cell phone? Was, was grabbing. Was dry. Are you sure it's mm -hmm. past continuous? Mm -hmm. Yes. Grabbed. Grab. Oh, no. Are you sure? Simple past. Simple past. Mm -hmm. uh, the driver grabbed. Grab the cell phone and alert the police. That's it. Yes. OK. It was simple past. Okay. Very good. The, the, the last one was correct. Excellent, guys. Excellent, Joe. Who is using the the blender? Okay, very. The blender. Who's using the blender right now? Okay, cool. Thank you so much. Okay, guys, let's go back to the stories and let's try to read it again. But don't feel like I'm going to make a mistake. No way. Try to remember, guys, that um, let's pretend that you are a reporter, right? You're transmitting this news to the audience. So I want you guys to, to be 
Ding, ding, ding. Hey guys, this is Alex from Inglés Corporativo. And today I'm gonna, you, you know what? I went, I was really dive. I went to the ocean and dive with my team. <laughs> and guess what I found, you see? Mm -hmm. And then you will continue. You're okay. starting the story of the golden fish, right? Okay, so that's what I want. <laughs> that you are like the reporter transmitting the story to the audience. Okay, so who's gonna start <laughs> first? Um, Francisco, you're going to start with the first one, okay? So let me go back. You don't have to like panic, okay? I know, I know guys. I know sometimes. <laughs> uh, okay, okay, Francisco, please give us the news for a golden find. The microphone is all yours, sir. Oh my God. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, I, uh... I try to continue the story, no? You need to pro do, to to give us the story. My 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 own story. No, your own story? No. The story is there, right? Mm -hmm. The golden I, find. We already know if it's past continuous or simple past because that's what we already have done right now. So all that I want you to do is to read the story, like if you're a reporter, but with more with more self-confident what you're saying. Okay, mm -hmm. the style okay. of uh, news, uh, news TV. Exactly, yeah. like that way. CNN. Okay, yeah. CNN. Uh -huh. oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Quattro Vision, okay. I don't know what which one you prefer. Ah, no, no. <laughs> but I want you guys, I want you to hear your tone of voice that you are, even though you are nervous and normal, you couldn't have a heart attack right now. But okay. it, I want you guys that you do not transmit that emotion to the audience. You transmit that you know what you're talking about. All right? You know okay. what you're saying. So that's what okay. I want. More self-confident. Go ahead. Good morning, everybody. A golden find. Why divers were working off the coast of Florida. They discovered a shipwreck containing gold worth two million. The divers were filming wow. a show about the coral reef when they found the gold. Wow, good news. Okay, this was Francisco Mulgar, reporter from Inglés Corporativo. You have a lovely night. <laughs> bye bye. <It's> <laughs> okay, you know, that's very good. Bravo. <laughs> Isn't it amazing? Yeah. Good job. That's Thank what you. I want. That you ton of boys transmit self-confident. As I said, mm. even though you could have a heart attack, I know that. But nobody has to know that. Okay? Mm. Yeah. All right. Very good. And next big team, sorry, next participant. Kathy, you want to try? <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay. You're <laughs> reporter, so you're going to report the number two, okay? All right. Allow me a couple of minutes. Let me go back. Okay, girl, the microphone is all yours. Go ahead. Okay. Four legs costume. One windy day, a woman was walking her pet pool, pool, pool down the street. A stylist saw the dog through the window and noticed the crazy hair. Later, where the stylist was uh, a new line of hair, hair products for dog and cats, he came up with a new slogan. Even animals have bad hair days. Very good, very good. But I want you to be like, instead of feeling like you're reading, transmit the news. You can, yeah, like that, like that emotion, right? You can say, in the hairstylist create a new slogan. What's the slogan about? Even those could have a, her, <laughs> uh, a horrible uh, hair day, right? Like that. <laughs> can you imagine? Poor dog. Like that, right? <laughs> you can add your own expression. Yes, exactly. A reporter from Inglés Cooperativo, Katia Monterosa. Mm. Have a lovely night, guys. Like that, right? You see? Okay, cool. Another big team. Javier, you want to try? I don't see you want to try. Javier, you want to try? No, really? No, no, teacher. No worry, that's okay. That's okay. That's okay. I, I can, I, I can. Uh, 
Yeah, how to use, yes. <laughs> what? <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to give you a chance, but tomorrow you're going to do it, okay? Okay, teacher. You no will problem. have that today, like the time to practice, okay? And you can do it. Ah, you know what? <gasps> Goodness, guys, you are saved by the bell. I mean, mm -hmm. say by the time of class because we already finished the class. Oh my goodness, that was time really passed so fast, right? <gasps> okay. yeah. This is going to be yes. a homework. Mm -hmm. So don't tell me like, eh, no way. Okay, so because I already figured, I already evaluated. Hey guys, I was waiting for the email that you were supposed to, to receive from your coworkers. What happened? You had to send it to me, okay? Remember that suppose Alex was supposed to send to Byron. I don't know to who, but remember the exercises? So I'm waiting for your responses. But now I need yeah. to receive all of, this is not going to be writing. This is going to be recorder message, mm -hmm. like a voice note. What I want from each of you, okay. I want you guys to pick one of the three stories that we have just read. I don't care which one, okay which one you feel more mm -hmm. comfortable. And I want you guys to record yourself saying that story and send them directly to me, not to the group, not to the okay. WhatsApp, to yes. me. Tomorrow, yes. we're Three. going to hear everybody. Mm -hmm. Okay, but I'm not- Okay, okay. true story. No, I, I just want- story. No, from the story that, I, that we just read right now, from the story that we have been okay. exercises. Pick one of them from one, two, or three. Ah, I don't okay. know. Got it. Okay. Got it. I got and it. I want you guys yes. not only to read, because it's going to be read, but at the same time, yeah. uh, I want you guys to feel like if you are uh, reporting that mm -hmm. story. Okay. Yes. And I want you, I'm, I'm going to evaluate a lot of things. I'm going to evaluate uh, your tone of voice. If I believe you about the story, right? Because you need to, I need you to feel like mm -hmm. you, you know what you're doing. Okay. And also guys, that you express your emotions, your feelings that you can like, if you're like leaving that experience, that's what I want. Okay. If, if you can say like, you can start recording yourself and you said, and then you listen to yourself and you say like, uh -uh, I stop there. I make a mistake. No, I don't like that. Erase it. Like, do it again. Do it again until you feel that you said okay. that's the one. So that's the one. This is like I feel like I'm, I am a CNN reporter. So now I'm going to okay. send it to the teacher. Okay. So I'm I'm expecting to receive okay. at least ten voice notes. Okay. And I, I I will give you a time, and you can send it to me the voice notes no later than 3 p.m. tomorrow. No later okay. than Okay. Okay, if you send okay. it later, okay. I'm not going to accept it. Okay, good. Okay, okay. And that will be nice, guys, because it's, it's, it will be different when you listen to yourself, how you sound in English. Like it? Yeah. All right, okay, guys, yeah. it was Teacher. a pleasure, okay? Yes, Byron, why? Oh, Javier, Teacher, Javier, you... yes, Javier. Can you share the, the image? Ah, yes, of course. Don't worry about it. Let me go back. <laughs> there you go. Uh, I, it doesn't matter if you choose the, the long story or the short story. No, as, as long as you uh, it makes you feel comfortable and you sound like if you're really reporting the story, it's fine for me. Okay. Thanks, okay. teacher. Okay, you're welcome. Any questions, any doubts? Feel free to ask or sip it forever. No, just kidding. Yeah, cool. <laughs> All righty, guys. So I'm so happy okay. to have you one more time. Okay, hugs okay. and kisses. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay, bye-bye.